to show you how to sign up for Quad Jobs and then how to set up your profile and your account pages. To sign up as a student, you literally just hit sign up, student, and then you'll be asked to enter your .edu email address to which we'll send a verification email and your school zip code. Just hit the next button from there and you'll be walked through the steps that you need to set up your account. Once you've done that, there are two very important pages that you need to fill out before you start applying for jobs. The first page is your profile page and the second page is your account page. We'll have a look at both of those now. Once you log in, go to the menu bar in the upper right and choose either profile or account. We'll start with the account page. The account page is really the nuts and bolts of your Quad Jobs account. You enter here things like your contact information, so it'll automatically fill with your .edu email address. You can enter your phone number, and very importantly, you can enter your primary address. For most students, that's the address that they live at while they're at school, but you can also enter a secondary address. That might be your home address or anywhere that you spend time over the holidays. The reason we have those two addresses is because you can match your jobs to either or. So when you're in school and you want to see local jobs, make sure you're matching jobs to your primary school address. If you're going home over a break, you can change and match jobs to your secondary address, and then you'll be able to apply to jobs that are located at that, in that area. Next, have a look at job notifications. This is important because many students actually don't check their .edu account very often. If that's not your email account, or if you prefer to be notified by phone, this is where you do that. Just click here and then you can toggle to the address, um, email or the text at which you'd like to receive job notifications. Next, you can choose the categories of jobs that you have interest in. It, might, it will default naturally to all of our categories, but again, if you want to edit that and only be notified for specific categories, just click on that button, choose your categories and hit save. The distance you're willing to travel um, is pretty straightforward and how frequently you want to be notified of new jobs. I would recommend no more than once a day, just because in mature markets, you could be receiving notifications bundled up to three times a day. That might be more than you want. Beyond that, password, emergency contact, and the deactivate account button, uh, should you choose to deactivate your Quad Jobs account. Next, I'll just run you briefly through the profile page. The profile page is the page that employers will have access to once you've applied to a job. Again, they don't have access to your profile page until you've actually applied to the job. This is really your calling card, so you'll want to make sure that you've gone through this page, you've spell checked it, you've included as much detail as possible, you've really put some care into it. So, the top is really just basic, where you go to school, your name, your school, what you're studying. Beyond that, it gets a little more interesting. On job requirements, you can indicate if you have a driver's license, you have access to a car, you can show whether you have our CPR cert qualified. And you can also give information about yourself, languages that you might speak, a chance to write a few sentences that describe you and your interests in a little more detail, and then you can actually give your experience. The categories that come up in experience are categories of jobs that we offer on the site. So this is your chance to show where you've worked in those categories um, and what types of experience you have. You can include special skills, any awards and honors that you've received and extracurricular activities, and lastly, a bit of fun stuff about yourself. The whole process should only take you about 10 minutes or so, but again, it's really important. This is what employers see before they even talk to you or meet you. So make sure that you make this as, as um, a good a reflection of yourself as possible. That's it. If you have any questions, as always, just contact us at mail at quadjobs.com. Thank you.